trouble things. I mean, you guys played like a seven man rotation on mm -hmm. Saturday. I know you you and Ben, I think, went all 93 snaps. But yep. does that help y'all? I mean, towards the end of the game, does it help keep guys fresher? Oh, it does. I mean, our uh, offense is pretty fast, so if we get more guys getting breaks like Eli and and uh, AG and all them, just keep them fresh, and so we keep a tempo up every like every play. So. How has this line evolved and Royce, do you guys feel like you are improving? You know, you had the 11 tackles for loss in the Southeastern. Those numbers have been reduced a little bit. Just how do you assess play right now? Uh, just like every week in practice and every game, I feel like our old lines get more confident. And uh, just what we're doing on the practice field is working a lot harder and just hounding down on our technique and uh, just like different stunts and keep, just making sure everything's in check. And uh, I think it's really preparing us for the games and just a lot less MAs and just we're getting it, probably the biggest thing is probably just getting more in shape. When a guy like Plumlee has that kind of escapability, how, how does that help you guys or how does it change your game? Uh, it changes our game because, I mean, it's just like extended plays. Like usually the, the plays don't go much longer, so you got to learn how to finish. Don't give up. Don't have a whistle in your head and because uh, you never know what's going to happen. Just like how you just jumped over that. That DB, like he's he's a playmaker, so he's got to keep blocking and helping him out. I know you guys saw him all in camp and all of that or whatever, but it seemed like the first couple of plays when he broke containment, like it kind of jarred Alabama's defense a little bit. Did his quickness and game action surprise you at all? Uh, not really, because he's been doing it all fall camp, and uh, the prior the week before we played uh, Bama, I mean, he was just doing the same stuff. Like he's just, like even in the summer he ran like a four three something, so he had he has some serious speed. That quarterback, and he can throw on the run, so he's a dangerous quarterback. It looks like since the Memphis game, y'all have improved in pass protection. I mean, mm -hmm. y'all feel like you're doing a better job of protecting the quarterback. The stats seem to. Yeah, I feel like we're we're doing a much better job at uh, just keeping just like the stunts and all the blitzes in check, and that's just got to go with the film. Just watch, keep watching film, but yeah, I feel like every week we're just getting better and better at pass protection, and and I uh, just got to shut them down. What do you feel like you need to do to get to the next level? Uh, probably work on my run blocking. Uh, it's like inside, inside number drive blocks and all that. that work on that technique and just gotta work on just getting movement on the D line.